Hey, fourth grade. Um, I wanted to give you a little video in case you've forgotten how to get onto Flipgrid. Um, we're thinking about using that and we'd like you to try it out today. So when you come to our remote learning site, you'll scroll all the way to the bottom. And down here, it has um, a link for Flipgrid and it also has a code. When we have you use Flipgrid, we will give you a specific code that you need to go to. Um, sometimes you'll go to uh, reading code, sometimes you'll go to uh, Mrs. Blackburn's in math or science. Um, today we've given you this code. So what you'll do is the first thing you'll do is you'll highlight your code right here. You'll right click and you will copy that code. And you're going to click on Flipgrid. It's going to open in a new window. You guys recognize this. We played with it before. You'll scroll down until you see enter a flip code. That is where you will put the flip code that you just copied. So right here, you'll click there, right click, and you will put paste. And there's our code right there. You're going to hit the arrow, and it is going to take you here. So from here, you are going to click Login with Google. Okay, My um, computer is going to show something a little different. I've got a lot of Google accounts on my computer. Um, I'm going to pick Mrs. Gerst. Um, you may just need to type in your email and your password. It is the same email that you use for your Google Classroom. It's the one that is taped inside your agenda. It um, starts with the year that you graduate and your name at stjohneagles.org. So I'm going to click this one here. My login was successful, and here I am in Blackburn's fourth grade. Then um, you guys uh, remember how we use Flipgrid. Uh, the first thing you'll do is um, they might have a prompt here, um, a question that you need to answer or something that you need to say. You'll hit the uh, record a response and then um, you record your video and then don't forget at the end to um, take a picture of a selfie. Make sure if your friends have left some answers that you respond to them. All right. I hope this helps. If you guys have any questions, let us know.